larger GM. But judging by the reactions of women of a certain age to Porsche's smallest youth, the Macan might just be the vehicular equivalent of wearing tight black pants in a hot room. The fawning isn't surprising. Porsche's newest SUV is a fairly irresistible redo of Audi's architecture. Aside from the compact size, there is no obvious visual connection to the Q5. Porsche's designers went to work inside and out, and though our test car lacked a leather-wrapped instrument panel, we didn't miss it. Alcantara and leatherette seats are standard. Skip the pricey leather options the basic interior is excellent. Puncturing the bodywork are massive front-end vents that flow enough air to cool a Class 8 truck. A black sticker on the bottom of the doors attempts to slim the visual weight. The actual weight for this Mac NS is 43.51 pounds. Moving that mass through all four wheels is a 3.0, liter V, 6 armed with two turbochargers. Every Mac N is turbocharged, even the S. The Mac N turbo's larger, 3.6, liter engine makes 400 horsepower, while the S gets along with 340. Activate launch control and the Mac N S will bolt to 60 in 4.6 seconds. That's the same 0, 2, 60 time as a 1986 911 turbo, the quickest car we tested that year.